One of the last tracks on my album Dreams is called On The Run Part 2. And it's a high-driven arpeggio part. Quite simple, but very effective. And uh, I used the Roland Jupiter 8 to create that track. And here's a little breakdown on how I did it. And what's happening here is that I have the Roland Jupiter 8 in dual mode, meaning I have two different patches for the lower and upper parts of the keyboard. And I can treat them differently as well. They're all being arpeggiated in a uh, random setting, a two octave random setting. And I'm syncing up the arpeggiator from the DAW by sending out a MIDI a clock to this dope for MSY2, which converts that into a clock pulse that are fed into the arpeggiator input, clock input of the Jupiter 8. And since I'm working on the stereo version of this track here, I'm using the specular tempus with a nice shimmer algorithm for the reverbs. And it actually took quite a while to find the right sounds for this arpeggiated part. One of the cool things on the Jupiter 8, especially since it's so old, is that you could uh, program the bend wheel to change the filter cutoff, the VCF, if you want to do, not only change the pitch as such. And that's what I used to make that um, filter cutoff sound on the, on the lead going on top of this arpeggiated part. Let's have a look. <laughs> Like everything else on this track, it was all played by hand in real time. There's no MIDI sequencing going on here. As always, I'm Espen Croft. Thank you so much for watching a little breakdown from one of the tracks on my album Dreams. See you next time. Cheers.